Jackie, what is the story of Anne of Green Gables? Anne of Green Gables is about Anne, who is an orphan um, who comes to live with Marilla and Matthew Cuthbert. They've decided to adopt a boy. An uh, orphan. An orphan boy. Okay. Um, to help with the farm work, and they get Anne. Okay. Not a boy. <laughs> not a boy. They have to decide whether they're going to keep her or not. She uh -huh. is very chatty. Uh -huh. And in this day and age, which is in the 1800s, late mm -hmm. 1800s, children are better seen and not heard. They are a very stoic family. It's, this is a brother and sister who's never been married, never had children. So here comes this, this, you know, this imagine of this crazy and creative young woman into their, into their home. And she just touches their hearts. What are some of the other uh, messages in Anna Green Gables? It's that acceptance, being able to accept someone who is different than you. Can you describe a little of the uh, look of the costume and the set and how you're planning on staging the show? Costuming, you know, we're looking at the eight, late 1890s uh -huh. and the girls are, um, they have what Anne Lovely calls puffy sleeves. So they are the mutton sleeved uh -huh. dresses uh -huh. um, that was all the rage back then. The farmers the, and their wives are kind of drab. They're, they're fairly um, set in their ways as far as the clothing goes. The set is, it's gonna be gorgeous. <laughs> I'm so excited. This is going to be almost entirely in the round. Oh, okay. Um, so we have a centerpiece that will act as the house, as the, um, and, Anne's house, mm -hmm. as Green Gables, um, as the schoolhouse, mm -hmm. um, the, the, a store, um, and then you have out, you know, you have the town that's kind of in back of you. So right. it is, will very much be played all around the center, which is the center of Anne's life at this point, is, the, is her home. What crew opportunities are, the, are going to be available? Oh, there are so many opportunities available. We are looking for an assistant stage manager who will write down blocking in rehearsals as well as help prompt the actors, take line notes and assist in tracking of props and costumes. The props crew creates and finds all the props needed for production, including the dressing of the set. The scenery crew may be divided into two different crews, a construction crew and a run crew. Construction crew typically builds several components of the scenery and the run crew serves as a floor crew or a fly crew. For The paint crew will learn several different techniques for painting and will assist in painting the scenery and any props that need to be painted. The costume makeup crew We'll do a sewing on prop costume pieces. During the run of the show, the crew assists with all quick changes and helps actors with makeup and wig applications. The front of the house crew will run all front of the house activities and assist patrons with anything they need. Responsibilities include ushering, selling, concessions, ticket taking, and monitoring the theater for safety needs. Members of the electric crew serve as electricians prior to the production. The production crews may involve may evolve into the run crew, or these crews may be separate. And when I think of Anne of Green Gables, I think of Anne and the schoolgirls that she goes to school with. But are there roles for boys? Absolutely. Okay. Okay. We have Matthew, who we've already uh -huh. talked about. Uh -huh. um, you also have Gilbert, mm -hmm. who is another schoolboy who is kind of Anne's nemesis. The schoolmaster is a is a man. Okay. So he is um, he has a very big scene in there, and then there's several other townspeople also. What else do you expect as a director? I, I expect people to be listening and ready ready to work, learning all the time, mm -hmm. different how to express yourself, what things mean your body language, whether you're nervous, whether you're whether you're angry, mad, mm -hmm. everything is, comes out in your body. Mm -hmm. And especially in the round, that's, I mean, they can see everything. So why did you want to direct this musical? I, I was that kid that, uh -huh. you know, your mom said, my mom always said, boy, she talks a lot. And she talks to everyone. So I can kind of, you know, identify with Anne. Mm -hmm. um, and it's, that, it's a great, thing for um, girls to understand mm -hmm. that it's okay to be chatty, it's okay to stand up for yourself, it's okay to be smart, mm -hmm. um, and those are, those are just a few of those huge things that are in this. I mean, it's okay to be who you are. Auditions are Sunday, March 8th and Monday, March 9th at 4 p.m. in the Carver Center, and Anne of Green Gables performs in the Parish Theater May 15th through the 23rd.